Well, this is day one of our lockdown here. And we know the army is in Bangkok and they're quote unquote cleaning the streets, which means they're mobilizing to keep people inside. And we did our panic shopping yesterday, so we're pretty well provided for. But just want to document little scenes of what we're seeing and how things might change. They closed up our pool and everyone's pools, so we can't swim, we can't go into the public areas or use our gym. And I see the building next door here, their pool's closed. But there are some people down here on the lawn. And these people are trying to get some sun. Obviously they're tourists that are staying in this building because Thai people would definitely not be out in the sun and make the best of their quote unquote vacation. Uh, you're not really permitted to travel in between provinces at this point. A lot of the governors have locked down their provinces and the Thai authorities are telling everyone to stay home as you well should. So our little tiny condo is going to be our only place to be for God knows how long, weeks, months. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. But at least we have our outdoor spaces and we have some nice views that gives us a little bit of weapon to fight the claustrophobia. You can see the temple across the street. It's usually super busy on the weekend and not much going on, no market, no one selling anything, and our very busy road here just has some minimal traffic locally, mostly taxis and motorcycle delivery guys. This is our local Chinese temple, and often on the weekends they have festivities. It has been quiet over there for weeks, nothing going on. And looking off into the distance here, this is Suwanapum Airport. But no flights coming or going, just a few each day. More people leaving the country than coming, that's a change. So now looking out on a different view of Bangkok from our kitchen terrace. And this terrace is really small, but between the two at least we get some cross ventilation. It makes it less claustrophobic. And you can see the construction projects are sort of slowed down to say the least and the BTS is still running but it seems like now you have to wear a mask and there's definitely a lot less people here comes the train now and here it is pulling into the station This person down here is the luckiest person in our neighborhood because they have their own private pool. And ironically, with their big house and their private pool, I've never ever seen a single person in that pool <laughs> in the three and a half years we've lived in this apartment. Man, I would do anything to have that pool. It's really convenient to have 7-Eleven here.